In this video, I'm going to show you how you can send Bitcoin from Binance to another wallet. Now, it's ideal to keep your Bitcoin stored off an exchange like Binance. Keep it in your own wallet that you own, that you have the private keys. And I'm going to show you how you can essentially do that in this video. Here I am on my Binance dashboard. This might look a little bit different depending on what country's Binance you are using. But what you need to do, you need to go and log in, then go to your profile icon in the top right hand corner then go to dashboard. And this is where I am right now on the dashboard. Now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to assets, then we're gonna go to spot. Now, by doing that, it will show you a list of all of your assets that you own. You can see I've got some BNB, ETH, Bitcoin. Now, we're gonna withdraw Bitcoin. So I'm gonna send Bitcoin from Binance to my external Exodus wallet. So here we have Bitcoin. We then need to go to the three dots next to Bitcoin you can then see you've got withdraw. So click on withdraw. That will then bring up this window where you can withdraw crypto. And in this case, we've got Bitcoin selected. Now you need to be very careful here because what we're gonna do now is we're gonna get our wallet address to our external wallet, right? So how do we do that? Well, this is gonna depend on what wallet you're using, but I'm using Exodus. So I'm gonna open up my Exodus wallet right here. So here is my Exodus wallet. Let me just minimize this. So we can go to wallet and you need to find your Bitcoin address. Now, in most wallets, they will allow you to hold multiple different cryptos. So you need to find the crypto that you're withdrawing, in this case, Bitcoin. So I'm going to go to Bitcoin, make sure we're on Bitcoin because you don't want to withdraw to a wrong address because it won't go through and you'll lose your funds. So here we're on Bitcoin. We can then click receive. And it's going to then bring up this window with a QR code, which is not useful to us right now. But it's going to also show us a Bitcoin address, which we can copy. So make sure you click on the copy clipboard button and it's going to then copy this address to your clipboard. And once you've got this address, we can use it to send Bitcoin to it. So now heading back to Binance, you want to paste in your address and then it's going to automatically match the network. So where withdrawing Bitcoin is recognized that. We can then choose the amount. Now I'm gonna withdraw here the max, but you can obviously withdraw any amount of Bitcoin that you have that you wanna withdraw. And I'm withdrawing here from my spot wallet. So we're gonna leave that as it is. You're gonna see the network fee, which you've got no choice but to pay. And then here is the amount that you are going to receive. So the fee is gonna be very minimal by the way and you're gonna receive most of your Bitcoin. So then you can go ahead and click on withdraw. Just make sure that this is all correct. Make sure the address is correct, the amount, and we can then click continue. We are now gonna to have to verify that this is us. It depends on your verification on your account. I have to verify with the Authenticator app and my email, so I'm gonna do that now. So after I've done that, it's now verified. It's now said withdrawal request submitted and it's gonna, again, give us the details. We can click on complete. Okay, so now we've done that. We just need to wait for the transaction to now hit our external wallet. You can also see that it is processing right here and it's just waiting for one confirmation. So here you can see it is receiving the amount here. So we're just gonna have to wait for this to be all confirmed and we will receive this money or this Bitcoin in Exodus wallet and we will be able to then use it. So this works for any wallet. Just make sure that you have the right address and you follow these steps step by step and you double check, triple check, you've got everything correct. But you can't really go wrong. That's how you do it. I hope that helped.